Sarah and Brent, back in May, Naugatuck police pleaded with the public to help find justice for a husky that was found wandering near the Waterbury line. Well, a tip did come in and it led to an arrest. From a scrawny, sickly pup with 28 inches of chain embedded in its neck. It was about 28 inches. There was about 20 pieces of the clip um, in the dog's neck. To this fluffed out, filled out, energetic teen. He came a long way. Good Samaritans found the dog named Justice roaming Naugatuck streets in May. Animal advocates Desmond's army put up a $1,500 reward, leading a tipster to shed light on Justice's previous life. The dog was living in a shed outside, was tethered um, via the chain, and it had been heard previously yelping and scratching at the walls. Police built a case against 38-year-old Emmanuel Pizarro Boria, who allegedly admitted to using the chain as a collar behind his home in Waterbury, less than three miles from where the dog was found. This doesn't happen very often that we we can bring someone to justice. The cruelty to animal charges is a victim who can't speak for themselves. Pizarro Boria appeared briefly at Waterbury Superior Court Wednesday after turning himself in on animal cruelty charges. He has a limited uh, record of misdemeanors. A judge lowering bail from fifty to ten thousand dollars on a promise to check in with the court weekly. Born in Puerto Rico. Been in Connecticut about 10 years now. Uh, he indicates that he just started a job about a month ago. Does report some alcohol issues. As a condition of these charges, Pizarro Boria is not allowed to have any animals. Now, Animal Control is looking for a foster home for justice, but they want to make sure it's a good fit, someone with husky experience. Live in Waterbury, I'm Samaya Hernandez, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.